Hey guys, welcome back to YT News. COVID-19 has hit us all pretty damn hard, like being stuck at home, not seeing friends, doing schoolwork online, and so much more. But what about YouTube? Well, that is the topic of today's video, and it's very interesting to say the least. But before we get into the rest of the video, please help us out by liking and subscribing to the channel if you haven't already. Also hit the notification bell while you're at it. Anyways, let's get right into it. Number one, monetization. Monetization has always been a very sensitive aspect of YouTube. In the last few years, YouTube has had to endure the adpocalypse. It was when companies limited or even pulled their advertising from any content that was not deemed family friendly. So many channels got affected negatively and their videos since have had nowhere near the same amount of money they used to. So with COVID-19 coming through, something similar has happened. If the word coronavirus or COVID-19 was said or mentioned, then that video would be seen as not suited for advertisers and therefore demonetized. Crazy, right? It is such a hard thing to do when it has taken over the whole world. It is a relevant topic today and YouTubers can't really talk about it without directly mentioning otherwise. Especially when creators believe that monetization is so broken as it is. They for sure are not happy about it. But luckily for YouTubers, that issue seems to have been sorted out and the word coronavirus can run free in YouTube videos without losing money. Number 2. More traffic So since we are all forced to be held up at home, we need things to do. Whether it is gaming, watching TV, or hey, watching YouTube. That is what a lot of people have been doing. Of course, there are no sports or live TV for that matter, and content creators are also trapped at home during this time. So they can easily make for content for their viewers, and viewers are definitely using their extra time to watch YouTube. So pretty good for content creators and for YouTube themselves. Now speaking of content creators. Number 3. YouTubers working harder We know YouTubers live pretty damn busy lives. They don't have to, necessarily. Realistically, they can work at their own pace and decide their own hours. But now that they're just at home, they could easily get bored by doing nothing. So they are keeping busy, their grind doesn't stop, and actually some are uploading videos a lot more. It is likely your favourite YouTuber has been doing this, and I'm sure that has made you super happy. Number 4. Different content YouTubers cannot really go outside and make some crazy ridiculous videos. Vlogs are also very limited to inside their own house. It is such a weird change for some YouTubers, but they have to do what they have to do. For example, the UK YouTube group The Sidemen usually film their Sidemen Sunday videos at a studio together or go outside together to do a video, but they can't do any of that anymore because hey, social distancing. Instead, their famous videos like Sidemen Tinder had a social distancing version now. They did it via Zoom, and to be fair to them, it did pretty damn well. Most collaborative videos are done over video call or discord and it is such a different dynamic to videos, but that is the reality of today. Thankfully our favourite content creators are still making awesome content. Number 5. Education People have decided to use some of their free time educating themselves. They have decided to turn to YouTube and learn something new like a language or a skill, home workouts and so much more. It is pretty cool, you can literally learn anything on YouTube, and that is the beauty of it. And it is all for free, which is even better. And there are a lot of good content creators dedicated to teaching people things, and they are really good. Number 6. More people joining Now that people have more time on their hands, they can do a lot of things, like making a YouTube channel. Yes, a lot more people are joining the platform, getting into the world of YouTube. Now is kind of the best time to do it. YouTube is not the easiest job in the world and it is very time consuming, especially when you are putting a lot of effort into videos. And fortunately for YouTube, people are taking advantage of their free time and going on their platform. Those were just some of the ways COVID-19 has affected YouTube. They're pretty interesting. Let us know down in the comments if you have noticed any other ways the pandemic has affected YouTube. Anyway guys, that's it for today's video. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to leave a like on the video and subscribe if you haven't already. Why not check out our other videos while you're at it? And hit the notification bell so you do not miss our next video. Well guys, that's all from us at YT News. Have a great day and we'll catch you next time.